Hello, hello, hello! Welcome to your character word. I am Tucker, and I'm glad you're here. In case you're new, I should add that character word is a place where kids and teachers come together to discover big ideas like kindness, respect, and honor that work inside of us to change the world around us. And teachers, we know that coming to these character words can be difficult, but we think it's always worth it. In fact, sometimes just getting out of the door and down the hallway with all your students can feel like you're pa uh, picking some epic trip and you're packing and it's just all around the world. Um, and Andrew, like, um, speaking of trips, are you going somewhere, Andrew? Um, apparently. Everyone, this is my co-host, Andrew. At least I thought he was hosting today, but looks like you're hitting the road. Um, so it seems. Tucker? Are you looking for something? You know, I, ju I just want to... I want to take it all in. I want to burn the memory of this. Oh. And, and, and I just want to remember it for all time. Please don't use math matches or any kind of open flame. I, 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 I want to remember this place. Just... I want to remember it when I'm gone. Which brings us back to the question. Um, In fact, I'm going. I'm gonna. I'm gonna take it with me. You know what? What? What do you? What do you? Gonna yeah, take? I'm gonna take it. What do you? Uh, oh. Okay. Hang on. What do you? Uh, I'll take this. What? No, we need that. I'm gonna take. Let's see. Oh, I'll we'll take this Andrew, microphone. Did, that can't. That's such a little suitcase. Okay. I don't, is that your teddy bear in there? Uh, yeah, yep, yeah. cause you know, I used that teddy bear one time as a prop and Where? Santa hat in there. Uh, I've definitely used this power cable before. Uh, uh, the mic, you know, it's mic'd me every, every time we do this. This is so, so okay. what are you doing with all of this? Like, what are you doing? Like, what do you mean, what am I doing? Like, what do you, do? like, is that a, is that a couch cushion in there? No, no. Uh, that's in the truck, okay? Uh, I don't, look. <sighs> There's something that's come up, okay? Okay. You clearly don't want me here anymore, so I'm leaving. You're, why? No, Andrew, um, like there's a sense. Listen, I saw, I saw the notes for today. What? Okay? What? Why? I you, saw the you, notes. You clearly don't want me here. Andrew, what, no, what, 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 what are you talking about? Look. Yes. Okay, I'm looking. This right here. Oh. The notes. For today, look. It says, right here, Andrew, terrible things, something good, out of bad, hope. <sighs> you, you're clearly replacing me with some girl named Hope. Like I thought oh. I was your co-host, and no. you're, uh, you've found somebody that's, better than me, and so that's Andrew. That's that's not that's not at all what this is like. Okay. Um. Like. Then I'm what is it? You, hmm? Here's the thing. Like, I see the Santa hat. I see your stuffed animal in there, and we're not trying to get rid of you, Andrew. Um. It's it's not that we're not getting rid of you. Okay, then what um, are you doing, Tucker? And those well, it sounds like that to me. No, that to, those are just the outlines for you know how we repeat after me um, that the big idea is like hey repeat after me. Yeah, that's the big idea. Like what's that's, the that's big just the outline. That's not the entire message. That is just the outline. That's just the bits and pieces of it. So what's the big idea then, Tucker? You trying to get rid of me? Is that the big idea? No, no, Andrew. Andrew, why don't we? Why don't we just do it with that? Let's do it together because do doing the what? The, leave? No, no, no. You're going to stay here. We're going to do the big idea. We're going to do the drum. You know what? Put your stuff down. We don't want you to leave. Put your stuff down. We don't want you. But to I'm leave. packed. No, put your stuff down, so we can have the big idea. Okay. So you know, you know, what? I'm just gonna put this in my coffee. Put this right here. We're gonna do our drum roll. That was weird. That was a little weird. But we're gonna do our drum roll, okay? Okay. So here we go. Drum roll, please. All right. And we're gonna count down three, two, two one. Hope. Hope is believing that something good is believing that something good can come out of something bad. Can come out of something bad. Wait. So 
hope isn't my replacement. Like I thought it would, like I could stay. I thought it was a girl y'all were bringing in to replace Andrew, me. Andrew, you're irreplaceable. We could not replace you. You still love me, Tucker? Yes, Andrew, we do. Come on. Like, oh, yes. like let's let these people get a hopeful look at a video. Okay. Well, what? Um, I, like, I need to get rid of So that. when you shut your suitcase, you kind of broke the microphone. Okay. Um, all right. Well, let me, uh, let me just. Andrew, is that a lamp in there? Oh, yeah, I'll take that, too. Oh, wait, oh, wait, wait, I'm staying. Never mind. Okay. Yep, you're staying. Um, well, as Andrew's going to figure that out, we're just going to continue with our character. Andrew, you're going to have to pay for whatever you just broke. Hey, guys, it's Markel here again. Have you ever wished for something? Have you ever thrown a coin into a fountain? <laughs> or blown out candles on a cake and made a wish? Maybe you wish for something you wanted to have, like a new toy or bike, or maybe you wish to live somewhere that was warmer or colder, or in a city or on a farm. Wishing is fun. It's kind of like daydreaming. But hope? Hope is different than wishing. Hope is looking to your future and believing things will get better. Hope is setting a goal for yourself that will allow you to have a new opportunity. Hope is understanding that you have the ability to grow and change. Hope is believing that something good can come out of something bad. Now, that doesn't mean that bad things happen so that something good can happen. It just means that even in tough times, we can look for a silver lining. We can have hope that things will be different and better. So we're gonna start this month the same as we do all the rest. Whether things have gone your way since I saw you last or not. So all together now, say our big idea with me. Hope is believing that something good can come out of something bad. One more time. Hope is believing that something good can come out of something bad. Great job, guys. Can't wait to see you next time. You're looking forward to seeing the mail today? <laughs> Oh, oh. Hey there, uh, I'm MC Haggis, the world's greatest Scottish rapper, and this here is my beatboxing partner, Seamus McFamous. Uh, give him a sample, Seamus. <laughs> oh, uh, now in French. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's a bilingual beatboxer. Yeah. Uh, this month we're learning about hope. Believing that something good can come out of something bad. And uh, something bad happened for me and Seamus, right, Seamus? Yeah, 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 yeah. You see, every year in the local music scene, they hand out what's called the Sheep Awards. <laughs> Don't ask me why a music award is named after a gamey smelling creature who's easily panicked. <laughs> Oh, right. Okay, now I get it. All right. Anyway, uh, me and Seamus submitted a song to be considered for a Sheep Award this year on CD. I, I, I know, we're old school kind of artists, you know. Well, somehow the CD got melted in the mail. It was ruined. <laughs> Here's how it sounds new. Sounds like a moose with a hairball, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, me and Seamus were devastated, but, but, we held out hope, right? Hey. Oh, hey! Thank you, disembodied hand. What's this? Uh, oh, it's, it's from the Sheep Awards. It's from the committee. I, 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 I can't read it. You read it. You read it. Come on, Seamus, you read it. Out loud, please. Hey, hey, hey. No, get hey. past all the other yada stuff. Okay. Hey! What? Hey! 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 hey, we won! We won the Sheep Award for Song <laughs> of the Year, Seamus! We did it! We did it! Oh, we, we believed that something good could come out of something bad, and it did. Oh, I think we should rap about it. Hey! Kick it! When things are looking pretty rough and the situation's looking sad, don't give up when it gets tough, because you can believe that something good can come out of something bad, and that's hope word! Seamus! Woo! What style can we do now to follow that sound up? You know, use that sound again that we, we just heard. What can we do? Ah, whale rap. I love it. Kick it. <laughs> Wow.
What is up everyone? I love this part of the day because we get to look deeper at our big idea and see how it plays out in our lives. You remember what we were talking about this month? Let's hear it again. Everybody say it with me. Hope is believing that something good can come out of something bad. And guys, it's true. Sometimes it's hard to have hope because, I mean, there's certainly things that can get us down. You know, bad stuff happens in our lives, sometimes in the small ways and other times in really big and difficult ways. Having hope doesn't mean that we just ignore these things. In fact, let's spend some time today talking about a few people who've had it pretty bad, but then things started looking a bit brighter. So I've got these cups here um, and they're going to help me tell the story just a little bit. So when I open the cup, right, I'm going to lift it up and it's going to release a little sound and that's going to be a clue about the person we're talking about. See if you can guess in your head who this person might be. All right, let's, let's listen to this one first. Okay. All right. Any guesses? Any guesses? Did you guess Michael Jordan, right? Michael Jordan is regarded as one of the best basketball players who ever lived. But did you know that when he was in high school, he didn't even make the varsity team as a sophomore? He had to play on the junior varsity team. Michael Jordan had to play on the junior varsity team, but he didn't let that get him down. Instead, he worked really, really hard, and the next year, he grew it. Practice paid off, and he made the varsity team. And he went on to be, like we said, one of the best players in basketball. All right, number two. Let's listen to this one. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, did you get that? Did you get that, anybody? Okay, so this one is about Thomas Edison. You know, the guy that invented the light bulb. Bing! Right up here. Well, did you know that Thomas Edison failed many, many times when creating the light bulb, but that didn't stop him from creating it? And now we've got all of these lights here today because of that. All right, let, let's move on to our third one right here. All right. We don't talk oh my about gosh, this is one of my favorite movies right now. Who knows it? You're right. Mirabelle Madrigal, right? She wasn't given a gift. Her family had powers like super strength and super hearing and could heal somebody with their food, but she never gave up hope and ended up saving her whole family, right? How amazing is that? All right, let's listen to this one. What can I say except I said the last one was one of my favorites, but I think Moana is my favorite of all. You see, Moana was left behind by Maui, and all hope seemed lost, right? Maui had left, his uh, club was broken, and she didn't know how she was going to return the heart of Defeaty, but she persevered. She shown kindness, and love, and strength, and hope, and it ended up changing all of the islands and their future. All right, one more, guys. Let's list this one up, all right? Mm, uh, okay, yeah, yeah, okay, okay, yeah, okay. So if you don't know, guys, that one is a computer sound, and one of the biggest uh, people in the world of computers is Bill Gates. He's one of the richest people in the world, but his first invention failed miserably. But later, he said that the failing that he first tried, the thing that failed when he first tried, ended up spurring him on to complete the second thing, which propelled Microsoft to be one of the biggest producers of computers in the world. That's right. You know, your story may never be like super big or super famous or like whatever, but I'll bet you'll have a moment where you think things are about as bad as they can get. Sometimes bad things happen, and there's not much we can do about that. Remember, though, that's not making the team, or you know, maybe you're not getting it right the first time, or you're facing difficult problems, and you just kind of want to lose hope. But guys, remember, uh, your current situation, it may be pretty bad, uh, but there is always better to come. Thank you so much, guys. I'll see you all later. Bye. I'm Lawson, and I was gonna be playing an epic bout of online Fortnite with my best friend, Rye.
but the internets are down. Why? Anyhow, I still get to tell you a story, which is pretty awesome. See, there's this kid Jacob in the neighborhood, and Jacob's best friend Luca lives next door, and they have planned the most awesome summer ever. They're gonna invent a super cool marble flinging machine that, that, that shoots fireworks, and then they're gonna have epic races up Mount Kilimanjaro, and they're going to eat so much ice cream that they turn into abominable snowman. Roar! It's gonna be so amazing. Until Luca's dad gets transferred suddenly. And Luca moves away right before summer starts. And to make it even worse, the family that moves in has a little kid. And by the time the first week of summer is over, Jacob has played every video game and drawn every picture and built every brick creation, and he is totally bored. Like, bored out of his mind. It's going to be the worst summer ever. And then, Jacob sees the little kid next door struggling to ride his bike. And Jacob remembers how he learned to ride. So he decides he may as well go over and help him. And over the next week, Thor gets so good that they take the training wheels off Thor's bike. And pretty soon, Jacob's got Thor riding with no help. And they celebrate with ice cream. So much ice cream that they turn into Abominable Snowman! Roar! And Jacob realizes that even though he still really, really misses Luca, maybe it doesn't have to be the worst summer ever. And there's all sorts of other things he can teach Thor. So kids, never forget that a quality summer requires lots of protective gear. And do remember that hope is believing that something good can come out of something bad. Internet's still down? <laughs> I mean, well, I guess I can actually go and hang out with Y for reals instead of playing online. I mean, he does live next door. That's good, right? Yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Hello everyone, my name is JD and we have reached the part of the video where it's time for you to brainstorm. Now we are all different. And while this is true, all of us go through hard times. Sometimes you see your friends and your family going through hard times and you want to help them out. You find yourself wanting to give them hope and you want to help them see good things that come after bad things. Sometimes uh, we're the one going through hard things and um, we're the ones that need hope, you know? My challenge for you today is to take some time wherever you are, um, whether you're in a group or just with your classroom or if you're just by yourself, but just to come up with some hopeful things that, that are good and that could come out of the bad. Maybe you're struggling in school right now and you're having a hard time understanding math, but you can choose to have hope and believe that through all that hard work, math will just click and you'll be able to understand. Or maybe you have been going through some hard times at home and it's hard to see good things out of all the bad that's going on. Or maybe it seems as though you are never gonna be good enough to make the baseball team. Uh, maybe you turn on the TV and you see other countries going through really hard times. Where is hope in those situations? Hope usually requires patience. It requires that we look down the road to something better. Hope doesn't mean that the current situation will get better because it might not, but it does mean that you believe something good can come from it. Take a few minutes to come up with a list of bad situations or circumstances and then think of possible good things that can come from it. This may be hard to do, but I am hopeful that you will be able to come up with some things. Now go ahead and pause the video. I don't know how to help. Ever since Whitney got sick, mom and dad have been busy and life is well, I've had to do my homework in the hospital.
we're all just hoping for the best. Nobody really smiles anymore. It's weird because she always used to be the one to make us laugh, and now that she needs someone to help her laugh, we can't even be in the same room. I've been carrying around that bag of letters and cards from her friends for days. I wanted to read them to her. You know, like how she used to read to me with all the silly voices. If I had to be outside her room, at least I could make a show about what her friends had been saying. I loved her face. It was time for her to rest. Her nurse asked if I'd like to do a show for some of the other kids. Yep. Well, Tucker, I'm, I'm glad that I was wrong and that you don't actually want to replace me. Andrew, we definitely don't want to replace you. Um, but did you learn anything today? Yeah, I did. I learned that hope gets our eyes off of our current circumstances. Those current circumstances could be bad. And it puts them like looking forward to the future and things, you know, things that could be better. Um, you know, it's it doesn't mean that things are gonna change. Like the circumstances could stay the same, but I look forward to the future of things to come. Oh, and that's really good, Andrew. I hope you enjoyed our character word today. And one more time, let's uh, let's go through the character word, the big idea, okay. and repeat after me. And it's hope, hope, believing something good, believing something good can come from, out of something bad. Can come out of something bad. Put it to work inside of you to change the world around you, and we will see you guys next month. See you next time. Sometimes things are out of my control. And sometimes I don't understand why the rolling thunder rolls. But when the rain falls from the sky, the grass turns green, the flowers bloom, and I stop asking why. Because I know with hope There's always a better tomorrow It's hard to believe the best But you can't wait if you give up Even if it doesn't work out like I planned I'm choosing to believe And I know it's hard to understand We can't always see the plan But we have our choice and this is mine I'm choosing to believe Sometimes I don't understand why the road